What's up guys, Samsung Galaxy S10 rumors have crystallized with information coming from multiple sources. There have been a few conflicting rumors, but by now, it's pretty clear what will be unveiled on Web20. Citing a reliable source, Computer Raja has confirmed this list of features. The Galaxy S10 Plus and S10 will feature an ultrasonic in-display fingerprint scanner, but the same will be missing in Galaxy S10 Lite. Our source has also confirmed the display and the battery capacity of the upcoming S10 series. Galaxy S10 Plus, model number SMG975F, 6.4-inch display, 4000mAh battery. Galaxy S10, model number SMG9735, 6.1-inch display, 3500mAh battery Galaxy S10 Lite Model number SMG9705 5.8 inch display 3100mAh battery In addition, the source has revealed that the Galaxy S10 and S10 Plus will come in 4 color options Black, White, Blue and Green The Galaxy S10 Lite will also get an additional yellow color However, the color option availability will vary depending on the market and the yellow colored Galaxy S10 Lite will be available in limited youth centric markets During the summer of 2018, Samsung unveiled world's first LPDDR5 memory chips for next generation smartphones and now we learn what we have expected all along. The Galaxy S10 Troy will most probably make use of new tech. A tipster on Twitter suggests that the Galaxy S10 phones coming next month will be equipped with in-house LPDDR5 memory chips. They are believed to be at least 30% more power efficient than the LPDDR4X chips and up to 1.5x faster achieving data transfer speeds of around 6400 MB per second. Samsung believes that the high-end bandwidth chips will power up AI powered applications and 5G phones which could mean that only the 5G enabled Galaxy S10 will benefit for the new memory. But we are pretty sure Samsung will fit them in the main 3 S10 variants as well. In related news, Samsung has rolled out media invites for its Galaxy Unpacked 2019 event where it is highly expected to unveil the Galaxy S10 series formally. The event is scheduled to take place in San Francisco on Web20. The South Korean tech giant is also expected to unveil its foldable phone that could debut as the Galaxy Fold or Galaxy F. So yeah guys, that's it for today. Now what's your thoughts on this? Let me know your thoughts in the comment section below. And yeah, I will see you tomorrow. Peace out.